Hello everyone! So in today's episode, we are going to be following the Seirai Storm Chasers and going to Seirai Island because that's the only area on the map so far that's available that I haven't been to yet. Um, what do I want to do first? First, uh, I got this new recipe for this thing called Moon Pie and I want to see if I can make it because I think it's Eula's special dish. What is that, rice? Do I need rice? Or is that flour? I think that's rice. If it's rice, then that's easy because I can just go over here and get some rice. I don't think it was rice. I think it was flour. Well, I'll still get some rice anyway. And... Um... The drinks are good. The drinks are good. The drinks are super good. The drinks are good. The drinks are really, really good. Huh. So, so they're not so good on day six and seven. Hmm. I think it was flour. Okay then. <laughs> Let's make some flour. Come on. Alright, well the other thing I want to do before that is... No. I have enough to get one of Eula's talents to level 10. This is going to be the first crown that I'm going to use. So, here we go! Yay! I'm going to give her... Uh, um... All level 10 talents. Oh, whoops. It's the money. Yay! Alright. Okay, so they're waiting for us on Seirai Island. So, let's take our wave rider and head over to the stormy area. Yeah, oh, super stormy. Before, you could only see basically like there's a land there with floating rocks and a big storm. Now you can actually see there's all these like plants there, there's all this stuff. Um, super exciting. So let's head over there now. Our trusty wave rider. Getting all dark as we approach Seirai Island. I'm I'm curious. I want to know why is there a giant like tempest specifically around uh, this island? So there's Watatsumi Island, and then Seirai Island, and then I think that one over there that hasn't been unlocked yet is Surumi Island. I think that's the only one left. Oh, new music that uh, has not been unlocked yet. Whoa. You can definitely tell this is like a sinister place. Alright. First impressions. It's just as terrifying as I thought it would be. Alright, okay, fine. You guys have a chest, so I guess I should deal with you all. Freeze to the core. Fake for mercy. Oh, I've been frozen. Eye for an eye. For that you will pay. More speed. Who's missing? You. Alright, enemies have been dealt with. <laughs> At least good luck doesn't discriminate by clan. Oops, there's a viewpoint over here. What do we have here? 
where swirling storm clouds gather. Yep. Swirling storm clouds for sure. That is terrifying. What happened here? <laughs> I like how, so it was very like sunny over there and then we went through the storm and now when we're actually here at Sayre Island, the sky is actually kind of pink and like lit up. It's very like, oh, it's almost like a different world. The sky is red, kind of like the plane of Euthymia, although I'm pretty sure that's not a completely related thing. That's just more to do with the fact that Electro is just represented with person. But, Wow. It's actually really pretty. Like I said before, Watatsumi Island and Seirai Island are actually both very pretty, but for completely different reasons. Hmm. What do we have here? As evident here. Kosuke Village. Someone's been surrounded by monsters there. Where? Fujiwara Toshiko. Alright, don't mind if I just take out all the silver turtles. Hello. You're all the way over here. Fake for mercy. Oh, Yula's definitely doing more damage now that I upgraded her talent. Okay, don't mind me, I'm just gonna, you know, do the puzzle first. She which side? Okay, I want them all facing this way. That was an easy one. That was nice. Cry out my illustrious name. Hi. Thank you. To think that these guys are trying to catch me unaware like that. Uh, who are you? I'm Fujiwara Toshiko, and I'm here to... Um... Never mind. Since you did save me, I might as well tell you. I'm actually here to find treasure that my ancestors left behind. And have you... How, how's that going for you? <laughs> of course I have. I've followed some clues to the treasure's location and have ascertained my met method of entry. Um... Sure. Can you really find it? Mm-hmm. It's okay, we're great at activating mechanisms that are really ancient. Uh, treasure map. Alright, cool. Yeah, I'd be happy to help you. Why are all these villages, like, abandoned? Not all of them. Only Higi Village was abandoned. Um... Oro Village and Konda Village had people. Higi Village was abandoned because everyone's dead or... gone. Because they were not doing so well. That means it looks like all your crops are still doing fine. I think the people on Seirai Island left because the Raiden Shogun told them to or something. Jesus. The Silent Fishing Village. Hmm. Hello there, crystal flies. Um. Let's activate the most important thing. The Statue of the Seven! I still remember Paimon saying that from the very beginning. <laughs> oh, this area is a lot bigger than Watatsumi Island. <laughs> okay. Well... 
Oh, there's a lot of stuff. There's no teleport waypoints back here. This back area. Interesting. Seirai Maru. A boat? Oh, look at that. That's a, that's a very scary view. The Raiden Shogun looking down upon you with this giant tempest swirl right at her, behind her, at her command. Uh, light up the Watatsume Island and Seirai Island areas of the Inazuma map. Done! Where is this mechanism that you speak of? Oh. Okay. Oh, there's a switch there. Let me take all this stuff first. How am I supposed to solve this puzzle? Check and activate the mechanism. Another puzzle? There's a piece here. Yeah, that, that was red. Okay, there's a... There are different plates, I see. I only see two here. Is there one around the back? There is one around the back. Um. Did I activate anything? Oh, I need to start it again. This, this, okay. Uh, what was that noise? Did you just see that? A giant hole just opened up over there. Looks like there's some sort of basement here. Let's go in and have a look, come on. Yeah, sure. Um, once I get whatever this is. seems to be of the same kind as the one that we lock unlocked on the way in. Just, you know, more complicated. But it's fine, right? I'm sure the ancestral map I got has some clues for us. I'm sure it does. Okay. Oh. Thank you. Thank you for leading me straight to the treasure I want. Those potatoes look like oranges. Okay. Oh, there's a, there's a lot here. Okay, well, I don't know what the characters on the ground are saying, so... I don't know if there's any, like... Pattern. Okay, it's not like that. Alright, we just have to feel this out until we get something then. Okay, this worked. So maybe here? Hmm. This is very good, like, mood music. It's like thinking music. But that's not even like what it's intent. Oh, okay. Ooh, this weather is wild. Best thing to do is dive under the covers where it's dark and snug and warm. Okay, I don't know what it means when like some of them are turn red when you get it wrong. Like some of them turn red and some of them don't. Okay, this was working. Then what do I do here?
And if I do the same thing, then the red um, appears in different spots too. So I don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Well, I know I need to light them all up somehow, but I don't see a pattern here. No. Okay. I don't know where I'm supposed to start. Pay attention. Oops. That's not paying attention. <laughs> okay, I got the furthest from starting here. Like that. That's the farthest I can get. From. Okay, over here. Maybe I come back and help you after. Uh, I think I'm supposed to be looking for someone. Yeah, on this side. Will this Electroculus take me up to where the... I mean, will this Electrograma take me up to where the Electroculus is? Yes, it will. Exactly what I need. There's like trees like, in the water. I wonder what happened. Out of all of the different areas, there's a story as to how they got a certain way. Considering how distorted Seirai Island looks, I imagine there's, there's a big story here. Hello there, jellyfish. Okay, teleport. That looks like a place where we want to be. Um, and this looks like an adventure campsite. Because we're supposed to be looking for the adventurers who came here. Oh, hello! I'll, I'll talk to you in a second. Once I've raided your camp and then fended off anyone. Never mind. Looks like they left. I'm out of here. Huh. Okay. How goes it? I need this book and then this one and this one. Ah, hello there. You're an adventurer? Hmm. Am I right to say you're here to investigate this island? Yes, you could say that. I see. In that case, you can explore the periphery of these, this island a bit. But don't wander too close to the center of this island as you please. The storms there are not to be trifled with. Are there only storms over there? Yes. Strange, isn't it? It's almost like something's drawn a boundary for the storms. That fellow Taisuke keeps insisting that the storm must have been the work of the Archon, meant to block ordinary people from violating a sacred site. I didn't believe a word of it at first, but then we discovered some very strange stone structures in the area. Taisuke read in a text that he found a, a text he found that these structures are known as warding stones. And according to the legends, these stone structures really are ritual implements that can be used to seal certain things. Unfortunately, the stone structures we found were all busted up, and not one looks like it's been repaired in who knows how many years. <sighs> we lack the clues to solve this mystery. How very frustrating. But since it's work, I suppose we just got to give it a go. Uh, where did you find them? Can you map it for me? Alright, let's go! Adventure time! Yay. Oh, hello. More of these little specter friends. Actually, they are not very friendly at all. 
vengeance will be mine. But I, in truth, I wish I could Shut be up. friends with all the creatures of the realm, but clearly they I'm all have other you. ideas. Good grief. So then I will instead collect up all of their item drops. How far away are you taking me? More speed. Pretty far from oh whoops. The insolent shall be punished. I didn't mean to awaken that walker flower. Treasure. Exquisite chest. Thank you very much. What do we have here? Oh, a warding stone over here. Great. The other teleport that I have. Let's see, treasure hoarders. Oh, I see what you mean by warding device. There's no end to this. Crush! <laughs> Okay, let's see. This seal. No, no. Taisuke, I brought the resources that you asked for. That's odd. This architecture doesn't fit. Uh huh. Uh, an honor to make your acquaintance. Mm hmm. Okay, okay. Let's see how we can deal with this uh, warding stone. That's professional ethics for you. Well, it's getting very stormy here. Oh, you're right. It's like there really is like a barrier guarding like the middle section. It's, yeah, that's true though. It sounds like you're working as an adventurer for the work and not for the adventure. But, you know, kind of like Rosaria. <laughs> so what's your reason for being an adventurer then? Yeah. Well, I guess anyone doing it for the adventure takes more time because they're doing adventuring. Whereas someone who's focused on efficiency but not enjoying, not in the enjoyment, can at least get it done more quickly. Just a different, I guess it's just a little different, like, reasons for doing the same thing. Um, Alright, here we go, the, the important stuff. Uh, they go from this warning stone side and stretch all the way out. Um, Okay, look into the stone and then look at these cat tracks. They probably are related. I mean, personally, if I got to be an adventurer, I would spend all sorts of time adventuring the world like Alice and creating all sorts of things, like finding all these new things and showing it off to everyone. Because otherwise, if you're doing work for just the sake of work, there are lots of other jobs. But, I mean, like, oh, we can just walk yeah, straight through here. This weather is wild. Best thing to do is dive oh, but the then we're gonna slowly die. Dark okay, never mind. Okay, so they're doing the warding stone while 
We go check out the cat for things. Oh, I can see it. And thank you for putting this Electroculus literally right in reach. I see cat. Hello there, cat. I see another cat. I see another cat. What is this? This, I think is another tree, but it looks kind of like a bone. doesn't discriminate by clan. Whoa. This is crazy. <laughs> I want to go over to the shore. Whoa. Yo, this looks like we climbed it up this thing. Please. Okay, um well, I just wanted to say this looks like an awesome place to take a picture. Maybe, how do I zoom out? Well, this is what I meant by I want to stand up, up on this thing, because then it's going to be like a perfect view. It does not want us to. Okay. Pine cones. Okay, now is our flower done? Okay, let's let's see if we can do this moon pie. May make a special dish, huh? That looks like it. A crescent moon pie. Yeah, let's just make as many as we can. Delicious moon pie and storm crest pie. You love specialty. I just want the apples, but I don't think we're gonna get the apples. I think we stand further back, we can get a nice, like, view of uh, Sarai. Island the storm. Oh, there's more specters here. More speed. More speed. More cat. That looks very spooky. <laughs> this is a shrine. A sauce shrine. There's more cat. More speed. Okay, well, there's also a teleport here that I'm going to unlock. Hello.
This is a nice turn. <sighs> At last, human guests. I saw this in the special program. There's like a cat shrine. <laughs> that cat, it's talking. It is talking. <laughs> Does the sight of this one frighten you so? Uh, Paimon's just never seen a talking animal before. Most rude of you. Are you not also a talking animal? The cat has a point. <laughs> Alright, calm down, everyone. We met a talking dragon and a talking snake. Um... Yeah, this is the first time Pine once met a talking cat. This is a sassy shrine, and this one is Neko, its provisional head priestess. Other felines address this one as her ladyship, the provisional head priestess. But since our fates are twined, you may dispense with such formality. Um, do other cats talk too? Surely. You just comprehend them not. Why can we comprehend you, then? But you are no fools, certainly, considering that you knew to follow mine instruction. Most boring thing would be if you were as dull as those other two humans, picking and scratching at rocks as they do. Uh, yeah, they're just arguing over the warding stone. Yeah, basically. This cat footprints what you're doing. Mm-hmm. Oh, thanks. Hibiki unsealed these rocks a good long time ago. It has much to do with those. Those purple, tingling, hair-raising, ill-meaning things. Um, well, yeah, Electro? Um, yeah, there's a lot of that here, that's for sure. This one can instruct you in the manner of operating those rocks. But in exchange, yeah, sure, anything. We're good at helping. Um, yeah, yeah, we know everything comes with a price, and we can pay it. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah, it's not that, right, that simple. I think people are scared to come here, even so. Mm, I think it has more to do with whatever caused the box to break rather than the box itself breaking. Um, yeah, it is hard hard to fault that reasoning though. So, um, Neo, I just heard. Uh, do you really know how to work with those warding stones? Huh, naturally. Many a time has this one seen Hibiki seal them. And unseal them, too. There should be no problem at all. Uh... Meow, meow, meow. Um, yep. Yeah, let's go get all this stuff. Where did the person in charge of maintenance live? Oh, thank you. I just imagine little cat scratching the map. Yeah. With your claws. But of course. There. This one has given you the general location you require. This one shall leave the box repairs to... You. Meow. This one is a cat named Neko. Doesn't Neko mean cat? <laughs> um, I'll get the box fixed, don't worry. Meow meow. Oh, I like cats. 
I definitely feel like I'm a cat person, but dogs are very good too. They both make good companions in different ways. And now this Electroculus is mine. Okay, let's check on the box first. Let's see. This is a very nice little shrine. Oh, I like these little these little circle flowers. They're very nice. Oh, this is a nice little place, so I like it. Well, this would be a good place to take a picture. <laughs> Cat shine. Ah, uh, this thing's in a real state. Uh, forget maintaining it. We might as well make a new one. Uh, we can use this, well, the parts from the old one to make a new one, though. But yeah, it might be hard to completely repair it, but the wood, the wood itself, does not look so completely shattered. Like this is still a few good pieces in there we could use. This is a lovely little shrine. Oh, it would must be very nice to be just, you know, a cat. And you, and you get to just sit in this pretty little shrine all day. Talking with the other cats. And dispensing wisdom. What is this? Um, there are a lot of cats. I wish you could pet the cats. Mm. Crystal fly. <laughs> yeah, Sayu does not scare the crystal flies away. What is up here? Enigmatic page. <sighs> Whoa. The storm looks really scary from here too. I mean here the sky is normal ish. Would I consider this normal? There's like this blue like mist everywhere around. Um but it's not like all like pink and orange and purple and all these colors that represent how crazy um everything is. Um let's just take a look. Yeah. This is such a cool place. It's just a little secluded area. This is another great area. I could just come here and leave a character here while I'm studying. It's like a nice little, like, oasis. Not an oasis, but like. It's like its own little island area that just has cats and a relaxing little secluded shrine. Yeah! What were all of you doing inside a rock? I'm gonna take your mint now. <laughs> Beautiful, I love it. Okay, where to now? Oh, all the way here.
All the treasure hoarders. What are they doing here? They are always here. That is just what they do. I condemn you. More speed. This weather is a hindrance. No more, please. We yield, we yield. Well, what were you doing here? We were just trying our luck. Just doing a little digging, you know. Alright, alright. Three, two... Wait, please! We'll talk, we'll talk! Ether's very threatening. Look at the two of them. Ether of Hymon, you should be afraid. We heard from some people that there was treasure to be had here on Seirai Island. That the island itself wasn't all that populated. So we decided to come over and see what we, if, what we could find. But, but we really haven't found anything. This village doesn't look like it's intended to for Archon knows how many years either. Forget treasure. We were hard pressed to find a plank of wood that wasn't broken around here. Uh, do you have a camp? Does that camp have nails, wooden plank, and rope in it? Actually, I want exactly those things. Um, what are you gonna do? They realize there's nothing for them here. So, yeah. Well, and it would be pretty crazy, like, if we start telling people, well, we're doing tasks for a cat. A cat asked us to repair a box on a secluded island shrine. So we are gonna do that. What is up here? And can I get the Electroculus that's on my map? What are these? Amakumo fruit. Yeah, that's where we're going. Right, but where's the thing we seek? Okay, if I look straight up, will I see what I'm looking for? No, but sometimes you do. <laughs> so here? Come on. Some of these electroculi, they're like super like obvious. And some of them, it's like, where on earth could they be? It was not straight up and down. Where? And away I go. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to anger you. I'm Make sorry. Forgive me? Huh? Yeah. That ain't me. happening. Shut up. I'm afraid. Yeah. Rack and ruin. Vengeance will be mine. Shudder. Eye for an eye. <laughs> at least good luck doesn't discriminate by clan. Yep, at least it doesn't discriminate by clan. <laughs> one side done then. <laughs> oh, another one here. Okay, 
Okay, I think we just walked into the storm, but please. Oh, I think we did it. I I didn't mean to, but what do that's, we have that makes here? it all the better. All right, that's two chests located then. I see the thing that I seek. And it's currently in an area that is filled with storms. But, you know what? This is the thrill of adventure. Adventuring seems sounds like it'd be one of those jobs that is best when the person doing it is really passionate about it. And it is willing to go to all the lengths to get all this stuff for the thrill of adventure. Otherwise, if you're like that other adventurer lady, there are lots of other jobs out there that you can do to make a living that are a lot more stable and less risky. And they're totally valid too. What is this area? Whoa! This also looks like a great area. I take a picture. I'll protect us. You know, without the, the current predicament at hand. Beg for mercy. I condemn you. <laughs> More speed. I can put these to good use. No, if it's in the cooking thing, then my ch ability to... Turn my controller off. I almost had it. There you go. Just keep spamming until you get it. Beautiful. There's this whole like glowy cave area, the trees and the red sky. And the lightning. <laughs> This is not as bad as uh, Yashiri Island yet, though. Where Yashiri Island just getting, we're just getting struck by lightning like every couple minutes. I was like, where did that bolt of lightning hit from? I think there's like a sandwich trail somewhere. What is this? Same form, same light.
does that mean? Do I need to light up the torch? Well, anyways, um. More speed. Oh, I see. I see. Oh, oh wait. How do I turn them all off? This weather is a hindrance. The thunder drowns out all other sounds, hampering my. All right. Hmm. What do we have These here? Are, we're trying to make the two match, but you know. I'm just bad. I just stand in the middle until it works. Shut up! By royal de Fake for mercy. I got counts. Cool. Yeah, sorry, your fellow treasure hoarders like kind of sold you all out, so I'm, I'm very sorry. Hey, look, some nails. Good. What is that? I didn't see what that was. Oh, that's more nails. And some planks. And rope. Hey, this area! This is the area from the... Oh. I'm gonna li wait, later wonder why I put a pin there. That's the area that was in the picture on the map from the first World Crest quest that... with the puzzle. Let's get down to business! Shudder! Freeze to the core! Eye for an eye! I tell me what this teleport. And then where is this Electroculus? I see a nice chest. A precious chest. Alright, fight me, everyone. We will duel for the possession of this chest. And I will not lose. I know you were probably all having a great weekend. But I'm here to interrupt that. Let us cross sword. Oz revealed by crush. Thank you. Thank you all for your wonderful cooperation. Now, this is mine. What we what have here, we have Eula, here? is this treasure that we just took from the treasure hoarders. <laughs> By mercilessly taking it from them. And sparing none of them. Not even you. We were as asleep as all the chaos just went down. <laughs> Vengeance will be mine. Eye for an eye. This will Which of these is the bad ones? Okay, that one. I see another chest. Yeah, that's totally the area that was in the picture that we just saw. 
really. Yeah. All these lovely fruits. It's just something very like ethereal about this whole storm contained to that one area, but just like in this very like rocky mountainous area that looks like it's like forever just torching the ground at that point to the point that everything looks like it's all broken over there. And yet the lightning bolts never ever stop. Cut down. You, you walked all the way over here to, to get me, huh? Beg for mercy. Crush. That went great. Alright, now it's time. I think it's about time we head over to the Asase Shrine. Let's go meet our kitty cat friends. Oh, we gotta fix the box first. <laughs> oh, we did a very nice job. Alright, let us report back to Neko. Well done, well done indeed. This one acknowledges your efforts. This should be the first step on the shrine's return to its former bustling state. You are also free to offer Mora yourself, should it please you. What are you going to do with the Mora? As we agreed then, this one shall instruct you in the, in the ceiling of those rocks. This island plays host to four such stones. Hibiki once said that they were meant to seal a bird of most... Prodigious size. Prodigious. A bird of... What, how do you say that? Prodigious size? Hibiki said that the bird's strength was truly a frightening thing. Capable of singeing the fur off of all the cats on this island. Oh no. This shrine, too, was built to subdue her. So this one heard from her. Hmm. Meow. The exact details escape this one. And it is a mighty shame that Hibiki is not here or you could ask her directly. Yet this one still recalls the sealing methods for the... Meow. Four stones. You must... Mm. Meow. Uh, okay. Hibiki said that the he is to use the ropes on the rock and a piece of paper. Um... Paper on one... On the sticks by the rock side must have become the same as the paper on the rock side. So. Whatever that means. Um, paper with paper and rock. Oh, you're gonna draw it. Thank you. If you wish to restore the warding stone's functionality and suppress the storm once more, you must find and touch the three sets of paper charms hung on poles that correspond to each warding stone. You must recall the positions of the, each set of paper charms and the number of paper charms on each pole. What? Three sets of paper charms hung on the poles that correspond to each warding stone. There are also paper charms hanging off the warding stone itself. Okay, so the poles have paper and then the, the stone itself has stuff on it. Okay, and the stones are split into upper and lower sections that may be rotated independently. Rotate the warding stone such that the number of paper charms on the section of the stone that correspond to the three poles match to the number of charms placed there. You know, it feels like it's going to be one of those things clear when we actually go there. Such a detailed carving. Well, small beans, it was really. Visit the shrine after some days. Once it grows busy around these parts once more, this one is certain that more humans will come to pay their respects. They will come to pay their respects once we quell the storm and they're less scared to come here. This one may, re may yet require your aid once again. Uh, 
Okay.